right, this is so exciting. Long weekend. Can you just picture it? Kyle and I going camping, right? By the fire, <laughs> we've got the marshmallows, the headlight, right? Oh my God, are what's you, happening to my life? Hold it closer to the fire. You gotta roast these marshmallows, Sorry. Kyle. My yeah. headlamp is, I can't feel anything. It's so, <laughs> it's so tight. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. there, right? Careful, can I get in there? Okay. MEC is gonna join us in 20 minutes and tell you what you need to know about camping. We're not coming with you. <laughs> Just follow their lead. Back here, Friday edition before a long weekend. People making plans. Emily, Emily Hinton from MEC joining us right now. Maybe going to go camping. If you're going to do it, you want to do it in style. And uh, you've got some great essentials for us yeah. to cover off. And uh, light is the first idea we're talking yeah, about. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you guys did a great demonstration using headlamps. Yeah. Um, so that's actually a kid-specific one. So get your little ones used to camping and give them little lights. That's why um, it was so tight on our yeah, heads. Probably. We had the, yeah, probably. It didn't the, fit quite the kids right. Ones, yeah. <laughs> so um, the other great option is our lanterns here. So these kind of look kind of a little antique -y, but they're actually LED lights. Okay. Um, so it'll last for about 80 hours, which is really awesome. Just turn it on right like that. Mm -hmm. Have a little flashlight. Or when you're in your tent, you can pull this out for some ambient lighting. Oh, nice. Yeah. And then uh, pretty much the same function with this yeah, guy right exactly. here? Exactly. Okay. So we got our lights as our basics. Now, if we want to bring some supplies with us, mm -hmm. tell us about these two. Let's start with this device here. Right. So it looks like a bicycle pump, yeah. but it is actually an espresso maker. Okay, now how does that work? You put your espresso in there, you put your hot water in there, you give it a little pump. It doesn't work with batteries, you don't have to turn it on or anything, and then the espresso comes out when the pressure's high enough. Really? Yeah. And it tastes good. Yeah, it's delish. Okay, and uh, we've got the press in yeah. here as well. So this is just like a personal French press. Um, you put your coffee in the bottom, hot water, and then push this through. It just works like a filter, and mm. uh, you got a fresh cup of coffee. Okay, very so important. We're getting the uh, beauty of indoors, outdoors as well. And hey, if we're going to go out in the wilderness, we need some ice cream, don't yeah, we? Yeah, we do. Um, so this is pretty cool. This is the Yay Labs ice cream maker. Um, so what you do is you open the top there. You put in like a cup of cream. A cup of sugar, some flavorings, chocolate chips, that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Play with it for about 20 minutes after you put ice in the bottom okay. and uh, 20 minutes of your kids like playing with it, throwing it around and you have ice cream. That's it. Just put the ingredients in, yeah. they're tossing this around. Exactly. And there's a treat at the end. Yeah, there is. That's a good system, Emily. Yeah. That is a good system. And okay, camping, I never thought table tennis would come into play. Yeah. Um, so this is a portable table tennis. So all you do is you use these levers here and it clips onto the table like this. Mm -hmm. So you can put it on any sort of picnic table, camping table, whatever you have. Paddles and balls and uh, keeps the kids entertained. That is such a great idea. Yeah. Okay, Frisbee, always a good go-to, yeah. but uh, I'm guessing there's a twist here. There's a special feature here. So this one lights up like this. 100,000 hours of light in that little LED there. So that'll definitely keep people entertained for a while. 100,000 hours, mm -hmm. that's a lot of camping. Okay, yeah. come over here, because you've got the setup uh, with the tent. Kyle and I were in the chairs earlier. Yeah, comfy, huh? What do we want to look for uh, with the chairs and obviously the grill? Uh, so the chairs are pretty nice, and the, the great thing about these chairs is they pack up really nice and small, but uh, when you do get them out, nice and comfortable too. Okay. Uh, basics for the grilling? Yeah, so this grill actually right here is pretty neat. Um, so it's a wood burning stove, but you don't have to like chop wood or anything. You just kind of put twigs, leaves, pine cones in the bottom of it. And this thing right here, the orange, collects the heat from the stove and is then a battery. So you can charge your phone, speakers, whatever you got, your camera, off of the heat that's stored from that stove. So you can still stay connected when yep. you're outdoors exactly. right here. Supplies yep. with the cooler here? Yeah, cooler, and this handy thing here is a popcorn maker. So whether you use it over your grill, over an open fire, whatever you got, popcorn kernels in there, fresh popcorn. And uh, might I add, this tent uh, right beside us, they put together in 10 minutes, which is simply <laughs> remarkable. Uh, what do you want to look for when you're getting a tent? Um, so a great thing about this tent is actually the height of it. So it's really nice and tall. So when you're in it, you don't have to feel all kind of cramped and claustrophobic. This and huge. you can actually get totally changed yep. without having to kind of crawl around. Let's jump in and uh, go camping here on BT. <laughs> MEC.ca is the website. You guys on Twitter as well? Yeah. This is huge. I know. Lots of room, can fit huh? in here. Deal.